In the spa town of Buxton, in Derbyshire, England, there is a beautiful blue lagoon. It looks like a great place to go swimming, but you might want to read the signs first. The blue lagoon of Buxton looks like something that was plucked out of the Caribbean and dropped into the English countryside. It's in an old limestone quarry that's been left abandoned, and it's filled in with this magical azure colored water. People love to go swimming there. They take little boats there. You can see YouTube videos of people doing flips and jumping into the Blue Lagoon of Buxton. There's some things you should know about the Blue Lagoon before you get into it. One sign reads, warning, polluted water. Water is known to contain car wrecks, rubbish, dead animals, excrement, dangerous to swim in due to high pH levels. This can cause skin and eye irritation, fungal infections, thrush, it can cause thrush, general grossness. Think, exclamation point, would you swim in ammonia or bleach? And I'm gonna guess the answer is probably not. So the water is not as beautiful and crystalline and pure as it might appear on first glance. But people go swimming there every summer without fail. And this really started to irritate the locals of Buxton, which is in and of itself a small quaint spa town. So it probably rubbed them the wrong way that people weren't going to the spas, but were going to swim in an abandoned limestone quarry that was filled with garbage. And as they kept telling people, the Blue Lagoon of Buxton has a pH level of 11.2. Ammonia has a pH level of 11.3. These are super alkaline uh, substances. It's like diluted bleach. Bleach has an alkaline level of only 12.6, which isn't a lot higher on the scale when you consider that normal water is at a level 7. So the townspeople talked about various solutions. Draining it wasn't really an option because it constantly refills with rainwater. They also talked about filling it in, but the cost and the effort was just prohibitive. So they came up with a more novel solution. They dyed the lagoon black. And in fact, it worked. According to locals, people stopped coming to swim in the lagoon. Instead of looking like this beautiful little island paradise, it looked like a cesspool. It looked like a pit of doom and despair, which is exactly what they wanted it to look like. So it was kind of a genius plan. But there's one problem. They did this in 2013. As of right now, the lagoon has gone back to its original beautiful blue color. And it's only a matter of time before the families and the tourists start flocking to take a swim in the Blue Lagoon of Buxton. Subscribe here and watch more videos here. I think that there's something else going on here because I don't think the local townspeople we're so, so concerned about the well-being of the people who are going and swimming in this abandoned quarry. Maybe they felt like it was a lawsuit waiting to happen, although, frankly, that was on the quarry owners. I think it was more that it was kind of embarrassing, and it was becoming so popular that it was clogging the streets and taking up parking, and there's nothing that pisses off a small town or more than when outsiders come and steal all the parking.